Uh, once again, thank you very much. It's another great opportunity on Fight Talk LB24 TV for us to come and see what's happening once again in Fight Zone. But now we're going to be looking at Muay Thai. Muay Thai is a very, very popular art. A lot of people are now doing Muay Thai. It's one of the most dynamic, deadly stand-up fighting system that exists a lot of people you've probably seen a lot of movies um, you know and, and Thai boxing is very very popular very hard they use their elbows they use their knees you know they use their shins I've got Jose Varela here, who's the senior coach here at Fight Zone London, and it'd be a good experience for us to actually get, gain some knowledge from him and what he does. So Jose, tell us a little bit about yourself, how you got involved in Muay Thai, what you do, what rank you are at the moment, and yeah, tell us a little bit about Muay Thai. Um, I got involved in Muay Thai, uh, basically I used to play football before, and then um, because I used to end up fighting any time uh, I play football so one of my brother's friends said look why you don't go and do like fighting sport I said nah it's not for me blah blah then I came to this country in 2000 I didn't really like the way the kids was moving around the behavior so I saw a gym I took opportunity I just went there to try and I fall in love with the sport so since then I just Try and try and try and go into fights, you know. I had ups and downs in my career, but it took me very far. You just recently won a competition, so tell me about that as well. Um, I won the world champion uh, last year. was was a tough fight, but I was I was confident. I trained really hard, you know. It was a great show. You now, I put a lot of effort into it, and basically, uh, I conquered the title. Fantastic. Muay Thai, what elements of the body do you use a lot and emphasize? What's, what, how is Muay Thai different from, let's say, boxing? Um, boxing normally, it just we only allowed to punch, which somebody with a, a little bit of a knowledge will be able to kind of defend and stuff. Muay Thai is really dangerous because it's elbows involved, knees to the head, elbows to the head, kicks to the head, punches. So we got more variety of weapons. So that's what makes Muay Thai very, very, very dangerous. Originally, what part of the world did Muay Thai start from? Muay Thai was, was, was uh, created in Thailand from the warriors. When they used to go to a battle, 
and you now they never had guns and stuff. They only used to fight with spears and 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 knives. So once once they got disarmed, they used to use Muay Thai. That's where Muay Thai was created, and then they turned that into a sport. So when students come to train with you, let's say in a session, what elements, what are they learning? I mean, are they doing a lot of fitness? Are they doing a lot of kicking and punching? How do you structure the learning in the class? Um, I pull a little bit of everything, you know? but the, the main thing is, is the, the base. I have to give them the base. The base will lead them to everything else. But majority of work more on techniques. Yes. How many fighters are you teaching now? I've got quite a few, about more than 10. So I got, recently I got one, he will have a, a major fight in K1 in, in the O2 arena and the other one will fight on the 23rd of April in the Clapton, so. I see a lot of ladies are training as well, yeah, I mean, uh, most, most stereotypical view would be Muay Thai is a very hard art, how can ladies get involved? How comes in your club uh, you've also got a lot of females training? Um, I think majority of them they're doing for the fitness, because Muay Thai, because of kicks, you get ripped, you, you get the muscles you need, and you get very fit. So I think majority of the ladies, they do it for, just for fitness. And some of them, they kind of like the sport, you know, the violence. They get involved in the fights and stuff. Self-defense-wise? Yes. It's very important because in London now, I mean, uh, self-defense for people has become so important. There's a lot of, lot of uh, violent crimes on people. There's a lot of violent crimes on ladies. So in self-defense-wise, it's very good for the ladies. Yes, yes, definitely. Because this, 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 the system here is different from the system a lot of us grow up, you know. So I think majority of the ladies, that's what they do in this sport as well, for the self-defense. I had, I, had, I had one of, um, one of my fighters. I think when he came, he was like 100, 100 kilos. Now he's 80, 83, 85. So it does help losing weight, get fit, get in good shape, and also helps on, on the health, the way you eat. You change the way you eat and all of that. What do you think about the film On Back? Oh, it's amazing. Uh, I actually saw the three movies, and it's amazing. That shows you what the sport is about. It's very religious as well. So it's no use to create, uh, it's not used for a bad thing, it's just used basically for self-defense, just to defend yourself against people who want to harm you. It's a, uh, you know, Muay Thai has, has a culture behind it, there's, there's a lot of culture, there's a lot of philosophy behind it. Um, how important is the cultural side of Muay Thai as well? It's really important because that, that, sh that shows you, um, that shows you the sport that sport is not really violent as people say it is. You know? it's, it's just something you, you can use on a good way. It, it teach you how to be more responsible, how not to be aggressive. Well disciplined. Yes, that's, that's basically the key. You know? it's, it's, a, it's a beautiful stuff and it's very religion. I think it was created by Buddhism or something like that. You know? So definitely it's, it's a is a sport where I recommend people should do it. Jose, well, it's great interviewing you. Yeah, it's, uh, it's my pleasure to have you on my TV show. Um, we'll be interviewing you soon, and hopefully in the future when there is some fights, if you let me know, we'll come down, we'll film, and we'll get some of the fighters in, 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 fighting in, in the competition and that. Jose, big thanks to you for actually Thank giving you us the. It was, a, was my pleasure. It's a great privilege to be here to interview Jose. Jose is a champion. He's a very lovely man, um, very gentle man, yeah? But, you know, if you've seen him sparring over there, I'm telling you, when he's inside the ring, there is a tiger inside him, yeah? Um, and I think that's what martial art is all about. The martial art is about you controlling your inner self, taking that discipline on, taking that art on, and actually really, really putting that art into a good positive direction yeah and I think all of us out there need to control our inner self as well and I think martial art helps and provides that. Muay Thai is very popular now and in the heart of East London you know people are practicing Muay Thai we're looking for future champions if you're interested get involved come to London Fight Zone train with Jose as well yeah he's a fantastic coach he's produced a lot of fighters himself uh, champions as well as he's a champion himself as well so he also goes in and fights as well yeah so look it's for everyone, yeah? You know, you don't have to be uh, 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 very strong,
but you will become strong. You don't have to be very fit, but you will definitely become very fit and healthy, yeah? And that's what we want to promote for. Thank you very much for watching uh, Fight Talk, LB24 TV.